So you're working from home, you're keeping up your social distancing, but you really wish there was something you could do to help. Actually, there are several things you can do. One, donate to your local hospital. Most hospitals in North Carolina are nonprofits and have philanthropic foundations affiliated with them. They do everything from rental assistance for healthcare workers to transportation for low-income patients. I think the best thing for folks to do right now is to make a financial gift because that allows us to respond directly to the most urgent needs of, of the hospital where money can, can help and where money can make a difference. Two, give blood. It won't stop the coronavirus, but hospitals still need to treat other conditions. For cancer, for accidents, for general surgical needs, and so the need for uh, blood in America happens every two seconds. Donating blood doesn't cost anything, so it's an option if you've lost your job. What you have here is our, is our packaging site. So this is Three, where we have donate to a local crisis assistance or, organization. Um, they provide food, rental assistance, and other services to families in need. And with the Labor Department saying more than six million Americans are now out of work, there's a lot of need. We need your financial support. If you're able to provide financial support, that is the best way you can support us. This gives us the opportunity to ensure that we're going to have the infrastructure that we need to keep going even after COVID-19. Four. Support local businesses that work in an essential service sector. Restaurants have gotten a lot of attention, but there are also locally owned hardware stores, pharmacies, and grocery stores. You also have HVAC contractors and electricians. Five, stay home and wash your hands. It sounds basic and repetitive, but it will take a lot of pressure off the healthcare system. It's most important to the medical community that we all stay well in order for them to be able to preserve their energy, their time, their resources, their supplies to serve those who are most sick and most in need at this time. Keep your eyes peeled for any fundraisers or food drives to help needy families or healthcare workers. Just remember, officials have seen a lot of COVID-19 related scams lately, so make sure that the charity you're donating to is one that you know and trust. In Raleigh, Garrett Bergquist, Spectrum News.